Hi, and so this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use the clone tool on Photo P website. So all you need to do, first of all, just go and open the browser that you're going to use to follow this tutorial steps. So of course, here in my case, I'm actually using Brave, but of course, in your case, you can use any other browser could be possibly working for you. So of course, when you open your browser, just go here to the URL section and type photop.com and hit the enter button. So, of course, that will certainly take you into the home or the main screen of the Photo P website. And from here, you have, of course, four options. The, four, uh, the first option is to create a new project. Of course, you can upload something from your computer as well. You can, of course, choose some of their PSD templates or you can just drop your file here and start editing on it. So for me, I'm just going here to click at new projects and choose some of the templates right here. So... Let's just choose this as an example. Let's just wait until it loads again. So as you can see right here, you uh, everything in this template, you will have it here as components, of course. And you can, of course, move them, uh, clone them, or do whatever you want with it. Of course, if you did something to anything right here, you can just undo it or click at Control Z and you will go back to the original uh, thing that you were at. So, of course, uh, here, where is, first of all, the clone tool? Uh, you will find it right here at the left option. So as you can see here, we have the clone tool. So when you click on it, first of all, so of course, when you click on that, you will need to focus or change the size if you want by just going here and of course, changing the size, the hardness or change some of the options right here. So of course, choose whatever you want. So as you can see, when you make it bigger, there is a circle right here got bigger. So of course, as you can see now, I actually like, of course, if you want to select what you want to clone, first of all, you would like to actually click K and click at the left click on your mouse. Of course, you can click at K or Alt. That's actually the same. Then, as I said, change the size of it. So let's just do this and let's just like click K this. So as you can see now, we cloned this whole thing and we can like paste it wherever we want. So that will be actually for this tutorial. I hope you like it. Thank you guys for watching and goodbye.